Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Baron brings Dylan to the palace. Dylan does not bring Ram closer, they sleep separately. Dawn comes and Baron is preparing breakfast for Dylan. And while Dylan is secretly watching Ram, Sabiha calls Dylan. Dylan doesn't answer his phone. At this time, from under the door of the room, someone drops a letter written on a small piece of paper. It said that Dylan would distract Baron and get to Sabiha's house. When Baron comes through the door, Dylan tries to hide the paper. Baron knows that Dylan is afraid and is hiding something. Baron finally went crazy because Dylan couldn't tell the truth. Dylan realized that Baron doubted her. For this reason, Dylan will try another way to alienate Baron from himself. Dylan talked to Ram and Dylan said she wanted to leave with Ram. So Dylan will try to clear up some of Baron's doubts. Dylan will say that he does not want to stay in the mansion and does not want to live with the Baron family. Because Dylan knows that Ram is the leader of the family and the tribe. Dylan knows Baron won't abandon his family. Dylan will ask Baron to make a choice between himself and his family. Dylan must talk to Ram and tell the truth. If Dylan continues to act like this, she will lose Baron completely. Baron puts an end to the blood feud to reunite with Dylan. Dylan risks his life by telling her to run away. Because according to tradition, if the tribe leaders hear that Dylan has run away, they will want Dylan to die. Whenever Dylan thinks of talking to Baron about Sabiha, something bad happens. It is very difficult for any woman to see a loved one pointing a gun at her forehead. But Dylan can act together with Ram and set a trap for Sabiha. Baron and Dylan can escape this evil. Of course, Kudret must first get Hassan out of the mansion. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click the bell so you don't miss the next videos. See you in the next video. Bye.